Hey guys, what is up? This is your friend the neighborhood who's here back again with another Isaac Breakdown. This time we're gonna start with Magic Brush and have a nice relaxing. Really, really not frantic. All stats up, run of binding of Isaac. I hope you'll all enjoy this ride with me. I'm certainly looking forward to it. I'm sorry, I shouldn't do that shit. Especially not for a full run. Come on. Maybe for a little bit. Is that even relaxing? I don't actually know what it sounds like. I haven't listened to that specific thing that I do. <laughs> I've, I, I generally will, like, uh... What would you call it? Like, proof watch episodes? Kind of. I kind of do. So what I'll do is I'll, obviously I'll watch the start to get the seed, and then I'll watch, like, near the end to make sure that my mic didn't fuck up somewhere in the middle, and make sure I didn't have to re- or I don't have to re-record the whole thing. That's pretty much what I do. So I don't really catch specifics, generally, while watching the run. Because I, yeah, it's pretty much just like, Check, check, done. Upload. Yeah. Well, it's more like, upload, check, check, fuck, cancel because the mic fucked up. Uh, that has happened a few times. I probably would have recorded 200 episodes at this point of breaking. This is incredible. Um, but obviously not all of them have gone up for uh, one reason or another. Um, pretty much explicitly one reason, actually, but... Uh, that's okay. Jesus. So, we're leaving the first floor with six heart containers, two spirit hearts. Uh, actual all stats up. So, I, I'm happy. I'm happy with where we're at. Let's have some fun. And let's continue along. With our nice, powerful build. Alright. Spirit hearts are rolling like it's fucking what, like, cars do. I think I nailed it. I think that was spot on. That was, like, that was really good. That was awesome. I'm glad that I opened my goddamn fucking mouth. Okay. That key's awesome. Uh, I guess I will not re-roll it, because I would much rather re-roll our... Devil deal, if it's bad. Pretty much, as always, the metagame revolves around your uh, potential of re-rolling the devil deal. And because the first two floors don't really have a lot of rooms, um, can't really re-roll, you know, devil deal and your item room. Specifically, that's the thing that affects the second floor uh, rather than the first. Well, it can affect the first if you get, like, a joker card or whatever. It's a lot more frequent to be affecting the uh, second floor, of course. Okay. Might not even want the HP up. I think six red hearts is more than sufficient. Are you a wizard? I found pills. I'm actually gonna, um... Yeah, I'm not gonna reroll the, the breakfast. I am gonna reroll... Well, I'll blow this up. I don't know why I didn't yet. That's incredible. I am going to reroll our item room. Is that better than rerolling our boss room? Probably. I really don't like the fact that we're getting Ghost Baby every run. He's fine. He's incidental damage. Um, so, you know, he helps. It's not like he hurts us, but... It's... I guess I should have picked up the Spirit Hearts before leaving, but because I didn't, I will grab the breakfast. I don't know why I didn't pick up Spirit Hearts. Whatever, it's fine. Seven Red Hearts, not even bad. It'll only be bad if we get, you know, Angel de Deals. <laughs> that would never happen, though. All right. Okay. We got bombs on bombs on bombs. We got two of the same pill. It's Paralysis. Don't really want to take the second one. It's not really my, uh idea of a fun time. So, 
So I think I'm gonna record some more magic videos. Um, uh, but this time in modern. So what I have done, if you, if you know much about magic, um, or if you are if you are interested, what I have done, uh, I, I recorded a some well some standard stuff, um, which is the constantly rotating format, roughly two years worth of cards or whatever. Uh, the issue with standard is that it rotates, so the barrier to entry or God, yeah, barrier to entry, barrier, whatever. Your barrier to enter is low, but you have to continue to keep up, right? And you have to spend more money, more or less, um, on standard than you do other formats. So what I did, because I realized this, and I don't want to spend a shitload of money on Magic the Gathering Online, fucking too late I guess, but um, because of this, I sold some cards that are more or less standard only, you know, cards that aren't really powerful enough in other formats. Um, sure. Uh, specifically Mana Confluence, I had three of them that I bought for 10 bucks each, and I sold for 17 bucks each, or 18 bucks. So that's pretty good. And then Den Protector, I have, well, I had two of them. I got one for free from a draft, and then another one from, uh, a bot for two bucks, and I sold both those for five each, so I got some nice return on my investment, uh, which is nice. It's cool. I really don't like you enemy that shoots fucking radial tears and shit. I guess it's not radial, it's like spiral tears or something. Radial's an outward motion, not a not a spinny motion. Okay. Please be good. That's pretty damn good. But uh, what I have done with modern is basically I'm, I'm saving that money, all that money that I spent there, or that I got there. I'm kind of saving it. Um, and by money, I mean tickets. It's like, quote, money. Um, it, I mean, it's money, but it's not, you can't, like, withdraw it. You know, it's not like it's a bank or whatever. Uh, so, what I did do is I made Mono Green Stompy, I guess is what it's called, in Modern. Because it's very cheap, and it's surprisingly competitive. It's awesome that there's one of these out here. Thank you, Gimpy. And with some of the money that I got, uh, I spent probably, what, 25 picks to uh, improve the deck. Just get the stuff that I needed to get, pretty much. Um, and it's very fun. I've, I've already done some testing with it. And it feels good, but it feels like you can just kind of get fucked with the draw. Like, the, the thing about a lot of modern decks right now is that they have draw engines, you know? They have ways to draw cards, and that makes them... That, that makes them good, right? Is the fact that they're drawing cards. Uh, their consistency explicitly lies in the draw engine, while Mono Green doesn't have that. So, it's a little bit less consistent as a deck. Why do you shoot? Why do you leave your shots? Oh, God damn it. Okay, Carrion Queen. You gotta stop it. I really don't like fighting Carrion Queen at all. Um, and with a shot speed down, this is actually like the worst. Okay. Uh, so yeah, the mono green deck, it's like, I don't know, it's, it's enjoyable to play. It, people don't seem to know how to play a, a, against it very well. Uh, I also, <laughs> funnily enough, oh my god, I hate you, Carrion Queen. Funnily enough, I actually, in the practice rooms, I played against the mirror, uh, which is to say, I played this. <laughs> I played the, the, against the guy who was also playing Mono Green Stompy. I'm very upset about the damage I'm taking, and I can't fucking stop it. Like, I need more shot speed if I want to stop it. Um, but yeah, in the mirror, the guy who was playing it, he didn't seem that experienced. In fairness, I'm not that experienced with the deck, but, 
I'd say I'm definitely more experienced than him. He made some very, very not great choices. Uh, but it was, you know, it was fun. I mean, it's it's like the budget deck right now. Like, Burn used to be the budget deck, but then a shitload of multicolored spells uh, got created. And now Burn actually costs money because you have to buy lands. In the past, it was like 20 mountains, some spells, and the only thing that costs money is Goblin Guides. But now there's like Boros Charm, there's a Tarkas Command if you want to run that. Um, there's also Eidolon of the Great Rebel, which is a stupid expensive card. Probably rightly so. The card is kind of crazy. But, I don't know. Burn used to be the budget deck. I think now it's definitely mono green. The only downside is I have Surox, uh, like the mono, the, the green Surox, who's like really good in green decks, um, but he's not very good in, uh, in modern. He's a little bit slow. By a little bit, I mean a lot of it. You're already aggressive enough with your nothing but uh, fucking. Okay, excuse me. <laughs> with your nothing but efficient creatures and aspect of the Hydra to. You know, essentially one one mana lava axe your opponent. I've definitely had aspect of the Hydra be like the most broken card ever. But what was really kind of weird was that in the mirror, um, what ended up happening was we had a board stall. It was like turn fifteen, and we both had like terrifying board positions. You know, like fucking. 30 creatures were on the table, and like, whichever one of us drew Aspect of the Hydra first, won, right? That's how that match was going. And my opponent then just like, alpha into me, like he's, he sent the whole team sideways. I blocked everything, right? Good blocks on all of them, except for one guy. And then the card that he had in his hand was not Aspect of the Hydra. It was, uh, please. It was Vines of Vastwood. And I survived the attack on, like, very low life, and then just cracked back over two turns and killed him, because every one of his creatures died in the attack. <laughs> uh, bar one that he kept untapped, which was a scavenge news, I think. Which, by the way, that I probably need that card, actually. Uh, I hope I don't accidentally pick that up, if it's, like, a lump of coal. Okay, it is lump of coal. This'll be the last one. I don't think we're getting out of here with, uh... <laughs> with many more items than this. I think this will be sufficient. Damn it! Alright, that's fine, actually. Okay. Reroll. Um, these are good. These are these are good. So, yes. And I guess we'll grab the same thing. We'll grab this. And 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 we'll use this. We'll grab this, and then we'll grab this, there's a joker, and we'll grab this, and then I'll grab this, and then we'll 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 use this, and then we'll grab this, and then we'll say see you later. Um, sure, whatever. Caffeine pill, why not? Bye. Alright, I guess let's backtrack and find our item room on Caves 2. <laughs> A reasonable, reasonable start to the floor. Damn it! But yeah, scavenging news um might be a little bit out of my budget as of right now, but I probably will have to invest in them. The card is just too good to not have, I think. Because right now, yeah, I have like Relic of Progenitus is my anti graveyard card, which is fine, but I think it's almost always better just to have uh, Scoos if you're a creature deck. So, Jera A. Well, thankfully we don't need a Joker card since we do have Goathead. Mm. I'm gonna pass. Let's use Hermit. Nice, actually. Damn it.
Yeah, while I was facing the Scavenger Goose, I was like, damn, I need this card. Because <laughs> it just, it kind of, I think I probably would have lost the match if it weren't for that. Well, what's weird is that, like, he was playing so slow that I won the match on time, which is kind of a not exciting way to win. But, I mean, there's a reason that there's a time limit in Magic yeah. It's so you don't play like a fucking goddamn sloth or something. Let's throw uh, a little bit of the hearts in here. I don't want to throw too many in. Probably four is fine. I'll go five, actually. I can live on three red hearts, I think. And I can grab this if I'm fast. Thank you. I guess I could actually have gone in there. I still could. Actually, does Dad's key open this up? Let's find out. I have no clue. I don't think I can backtrack to get the D6 if it does open it. So. It did open it, and there is a secret room. So I'm basically, I'm just gonna do this. And, and I'm gonna wait and do that. Bombs are key. Let's just leave it how it is. What do we got in here? Um, let's blow this up and blow this up. Really? <laughs> Alright. That's fine, I guess. And then we'll grab this. And I'll leave. That was a productive floor. Uh, oh yeah, like I was saying about the, uh, Magic the Gathering stuff. I'll probably do some daily events with the Mono Green deck. Um, because it's pretty good. Right, I should have probably rerolled this, actually. Yeah, that was dumb. Forgot how many spacebar items there were. But I've, I've basically been wanting to get into dailies so I can actually finally, you know, stop dumping money in and actually just, like, have money in. Uh, because daily events are the best way to... Um essentially go infinite, because in constructed dailies, so like modern, standard, uh, legacy, whatever, uh, popper as well, the, the packs that they pay out with mean that uh, if you 3-1 every other daily event, which sounds very reasonable, um, then you go actually infinite, like you're net positiving some number of tickets depending on the the packs at the time. And right now, they're hanging out with Dragons of Tarkir, which is a pretty reasonably high-priced pack. Um, so it's pretty good value right now. Yeah, sure. Why not? Just add more stats to the pile. BFF sounds pretty good. I'll take it. Uh, I'll also take these, because I got money. Bidets? I could probably donate. Eh, whatever. I don't take money out of the donation machine that often anymore, so I think I'll be okay. Deal with the angel, huh? Not really what I'm looking forward to, but... I can do this. It's pretty good. Um, I would like to reroll Breath of Life. Where am I? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I would like to reroll that. Um, because Breath of Life is shit, so. I would, you know, I mean, like, I, I wouldn't uh, look down on a. I don't know, like a Godhead or a Sacred Art. I would look down on that item. Not what I want. I need to actually trade away hit points, though, for something. Nine red hearts is not my idea of a good amount. <laughs> I 
I mean, it's a, it's a great amount. Right? It's tidy, so it should be a black market or crawl space. It is a crawl space with a single red chest. Three bombs for red chest. And it. Balls of steel. Locked down. Alright, it was awful. Sit in the bed. Eh. Alright, well, I guess that does that. Oh, there's a battery over there. I forgot about that. Okay, sure. Um, I guess we can also check out this room. And we have Holy Mantle too, so that's great. Gubby's tail is awesome. So do I reroll? Yeah, I think I reroll Angel Room because I think this will probably be our last Angel Room. We'll see. Celtic Cross ain't bad. I'll take that. I'll I'll be happy with that too. Okay. I'm not taking the HP up, by the way. <laughs> um, I do not want more. Golden key is sweet. Sure, dude. Let's check this way. I'm basically trying to figure out if I can get into that. Well. <sighs> okay. I'm going to use the D6 for the rest of the floor, but I'm not going to ditch... Tammy's head. It's Brim Tammy. How do I how do I ditch Brim Tammy? You gotta be some kind of crazy person to ditch Brim Tammy. I might be a crazy person who ditches Brim Tammy. We'll find out. I don't wanna. I really don't wanna ditch it. But I kinda do wanna ditch it. I kind of really want to just have a D6 for our Jerry. You know what? That's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to roll with D6. I'm sorry. I'm a crazy person. Yeah. I'm a crazy person. I know. I know how fucking good this is. And how stupid I am for ditching it, but... You know what? A man's got to do what a man's got to do. And in this case, I don't quite know what I got to do, but I'm, I got to do it. Oops. Um, that's awful, actually. Uh, thank you. <laughs> I was like, hang on. Should have the money for this. Well, that was actually really bad, buying that extra battery. I don't think it matters. I don't think the small amounts of money is going to make a huge difference. Alright, if we're fast, we can actually get to our... Stupid, dumb, idiot, uh, boss rush. So let's do that, actually. I think it's Pisces. I think it's gotta be Pisces. Brimstone with Libra is kind of a non -win. A little bit more than kind of, I think, actually. I think it's pretty bad. stand up about here, I think. <laughs> Alright, nice and easy. good so far, I think. This is a pretty straightforward boss rush. I hate how the Widow, like, doesn't get overkilled at all. Like, it's the only boss that does that, too. Which is weird. No, please. No, God. Alright, fine. That works. Okay. Um, sure. I'll take it in the station. Because, fuck it. <laughs> I'd rather reroll whatever we got in here. Or, I'll just take it, and then pick up the trillions of spirit hearts, uh, that are here. 
and uh, say see ya. That was an incredible pickup. Abaddon is crazy. Item is way too good. But not like way too good as in it needs to get altered or whatever because try balancing a single player game is fucking silly, but whatever. I mean, at least like min maxi balances. I'll, I'll understand balancing, you know, but like not fucking like, oh, it took, took away a little bit of damage off of this item because it was too good. No, like, especially not Isaac. Isaac's the kind of game where it's like, you're supposed to be overpowered sometimes and underpowered other times. And for certain people, you're supposed to be underpowered a lot of the time and overpowered occasionally. Uh, I don't know who those people would be. <laughs> Definitely not me, am I right? Okay, what do we got? Mama Goidi. See you later. Yeah, Cat of Nine Tails is sick. Sick and nasty. These items are sweet, but I want Guppy. God damn it. Um, I will grab this because that's crazy good. But I do want Guppy so bad that I'm going to commit to it. I'm committed. Come on, Dark Bomb. I'm going to get Guppy. I'm sure of it. I have Tail, right? Yeah. Okay. So we are one part away from being Guppy. Two more rerolls, it seems. Could be more than two more, but I think it's just two more. I doubt we're gonna get that many rooms left. Some. Let's just pop it just to double check. Oh, um, hmm. Mm, I guess it's two, right? I haven't counted yet, and also there's a few empty rooms, so. Low Devil. Um,. Let's do some actual counting. Okay, so we got one, two, three, four, potentially five. So yeah, we're, we only get one more reroll. Or two more, I guess, because of the, the battery. Unless another battery drops, in which case we'll have a third. Hopefully we won't need any more than this one that we're going to do right now. All right, we didn't actually need more than that. We nailed it. Easy. Got there. I guess I'm just going to backtrack for the battery and spirit hearts. I guess I should let Senor Bum take care of the red hearts that we got lying around. Well, I guess let's finish the floor, whatever. Oh, we had to curse the maze on this floor. Alright, well, wonder where that was. Alright. Okay, empty. And, ooh. I'll take I'll take a dead cat. Sign me up for one dead cat, please. Alright, Dark Bum, you gotta you gotta grab these, bud. Thank you. Uh, I guess we'll blow this open. We have plenty of bombs. Oh, it's super great. Alright, see ya. Nice seeing you again. Okay, so holding on to the Yera, the Jura. I guess if there was, eh, would that have, yeah, I guess that would have been enough if there wasn't all those empty rooms. If there was like one less empty room or whatever. Interesting. Mm, interesting. I didn't get to shoot him! Come on, flies. I gotta be that way. Mm, mm, I mean, I should play you. But then there's this thing that I possess called laziness. It's a, a horrific disease that affects millions every year. Potentially billions, even. But 
with our with your help we can stop this epidemic all right I would like more key drops all these luck down see this is the situation where I would have loved that PhD because that's a lot of luck ups that would have been there all right well I guess there's one way to go batteries cool money is fine but it doesn't buy happiness everybody knows that I'll be real with you. I think money might buy my happiness. If somebody comes up to me and is like, here, have fucking $3,000, I think I'm gonna be pretty goddamn happy about that. I don't know. Okay, I shot the wrong direction, but it didn't actually. Hey, Duck Bomb, you wanna grab that one? Just grab it for the road? For the road, eh? Sorry, my, my youper came out. Just a little bit. <laughs> I, I gotta. You know, I'm not gonna make a joke about it. I've already made jokes about it. Oh my god! This is the best case scenario! Ah! Oh, I love this room, it's so fun. Where are you all? Oh, there you are. <laughs> Dark bum! <laughs> I don't know what to do with you. You're gonna just be spewing out spirit hearts for fucking hours. I didn't want for this to happen, dude. Alright. This is a pretty good situation, I think. We'll see. There's not a lot of books left. Um, These are pretty good. Oh, that's it, Dark Bum? Yeah. I'll... Okay. Alright. I mean, there's still more red hearts. <laughs> I hate. I hate that the knights have a delay before they actually get hit. Blah! What do we got in here? A one room. <laughs> yeah, good joke. It's really funny. See you later. Fuck it. You know what? I don't care about the library. I, I'm gonna get enough pedestals on this next floor anyway that I don't think the library matters. Jera. Open. 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 Alright, these are all shit. Alright, these are all shit. I mean, they're not all shit. It's just they're not interesting. And I want interesting shit. I did it. I can only open one. Oh, that's interesting. I wonder what the other chest can make. Hmm. Lesson 3 is not interesting. I am a big fan of Big Fan, though. Um, so yes. That's about it. It's either that boring or whatever. It's just, you know. I need uh, I need a spoon bender or a Loki's horns or a, I don't know, a something. I need a something. In fact, all of the above would be sweet. I wouldn't be opposed to that. So unfortunately, uh, the way that the uh, tiny planet works is kind of weird. Ah. Um, nope. 
So Tiny Planet, it looks like you could hit somebody with like two of the same shot, but it's all one continuous hitbox, so they only get hit. Uh, it, it only counts as one beam, which is it's disappointing, I guess. That's less weird and more just like, it'd be fucking sweet if, you know, either way. Alright, better get something soon. No, I guess I'll take the wig just because there's not a lot of items left and Mom's wig is pretty good. It definitely seems like though, uh, Tiny Planet with Quad Shop Brimstone does decrease the spread, I think. It looks like it does. If it doesn't, then oops, but I think it might. Oh, no. Alright, we gotta have greed. It's gotta be greed. That might not even hit it. Alright, it did. Greed! Damn it! Cox. Well, I guess we're just grabbing everything, then. Ooh, boring as fuck. Ooga chaka, ooga, ooga, ooga chaka. Whatever. It's fucking boring. Ugh. What an unexciting run. Bleh. If you guys hated it too, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you did enjoy it. If you did, of course, please be sure to leave a like and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. See more Isaac in the future, etc. Blah, blah, blah. You've heard it all before. Uh, I'll see you next time.